This video shows Commotion CNC's fiducial alignment and geometric transformation capability. Certain applications require a theoretical CAD defined motion pattern to be performed on a somewhat misplaced substrate. Fiducial marks on the substrate corresponding to known positions in the CAD pattern can be measured to determine a transformation that will properly map the CAD position onto the substrate. Two fiducials can provide angle of rotation, XY scale, and XY offsets. Commotion's libraries contain a powerful geometric correction capability. A table of measured actuator positions, each corresponding to a theoretical CAD space grid position, can be used to transform CAD positions into corrected actuator positions. The simplest geocorrection table consists of only four points. This results in a linear transformation that has eight degrees of freedom, which can more than correct for rotation, scale, and XY offset. Here we show Commotion CNC running, and we have configured a user button to bring up the fiducial alignment program, which is written as an external C sharp application. The user button actually launches a batch file, which in turn launches the measure fiducial app so that it is not hidden as the batch file is, and it's started as a separate Windows process. Here's the actual batch file used. Pushing the button brings up the alignment app. The app has a video window that can be resized, also a crosshair overlay. For this simple demo we just have a magnified view of a motor shaft to verify that one axis ends up being properly aligned. We've marked two spots to represent a left and a right fiducial mark. Note that dragging the mouse on the image also moves the axes. On the left is an XY position display of the raw uncorrected axis positions. Where the left and right fiducials are in CAD space must be entered here. The positions can be saved and reloaded from a text file here. Here we have already specified the left target is at minus 4 Y 0.2 and the right is at x plus 5 and y.2. Now let's actually do an alignment. Pushing the go button under the left theoretical position will move the axis to that position which should be close to where the fiducial actually is. We can then align it. Pushing the measure button will capture that measured actuator position. We can now repeat the same thing for the right fiducial mark. We can verify the measured positions by moving back and forth between them by pushing the go button under the measured column. The fiducials can be remeasured if necessary. Now we have the measurements necessary to do the correction. Let's resize this screen to see if we can see both the commotion CNC DROs and the fiducial alignment raw machine coordinates. Notice the positions match because we're not yet to have a correction. Pushing the Compute GeoCorrection will create the Geo table and apply it to Commotion CNC. Notice Commotion CNC now reports the theoretical position of the right fiducial because that's where we're at. So 
Similarly, if we go to the left measured position, Motion CNC reports the theoretical left position, even though the raw axis positions are at the adjusted position. Similarly, if we run G code to move to the theoretical right position, we actually move to the right position and the raw position matches the measured uh, corrected position. Same with the left. That's it.